I'm going to explain what exactly is happening right now. Where's my phone? Where is my phone? I just had it. Where is my phone? Lovely that. Lovely that. Mm -hmm. It's the 19th of February 2024. I'm leaving for Belfast tomorrow. I'm getting up tomorrow as like a normal day. I'm trying to sleep until 3.30. Me and Isaac, we won't be able to sleep anyways because we're so excited. And we're book besties. And what do book besties do when they can't sleep? They read. I get literally so anxious just thinking about sleeping a little bit too much. Although we have two hours at the airport and it's the middle of the freaking night so nobody's gonna be there, but I'm scared. We're leaving at 4 a.m. in the morning. My dad is the kindest person in the whole entire wide world ever. If you've never met my dad, I feel sorry for you. I feel sorry for anyone that doesn't have my dad as a dad because my dad is the best dad and you can't tell me otherwise. I don't care about Al's dad, mine is the best one and he is wonderful, I love him. He is driving us to the airport in the middle of the freaking night. He's the kindest person ever for that and also for everything else he does for me and for supporting me and everything I do and for being the kindest dad ever, I love you. If you're watching this, dad, I love you. I mean to be there at like five, it takes like two and a half hours, I believe to fly to London. We're flying with British Airways, if anyone's wondering. Landing in London two and a half hours later, and then our next plane from London to Belfast leaves later in the evening. Yeah, and then we wake up the next day, and it's Wednesday, and we're literally going to see Niall Horan. So, if you can't tell by my voice, I literally have a throat infection. How fortunate for me. In fact, it was supposed to last for four days. <laughs> Babe, it's been seven, almost eight days. That's double the amount of what I thought. Uh, Google is lying to my face. But anyways, second of all, on Sunday, I was at a concert. Marcus and Martinez kicked off the concert season perfectly. Absolutely loved it. They were amazing. They were stupid hot. I wanted to marry them. Mostly Martinez. So Martinez can actually say that. So he's me up. Anyways. <laughs> so right now I'm gonna pack. I have a whole packing list. So I just need to find my things. First, I'm going to give you guys a try on of the outfit for Belfast that I'm wearing at the Mad concert. So since I didn't want to buy anything past fashion i took some pants that i had that i never used but i like the fit up and i took a jacket that i also never used and that could fit, fit perfectly for the weather in belfast right now so i'm gonna show you and i haven't worn it yet so it's the first time for me as well okay something that's not that positive is that they literally have paint stains all over them y'all are not ready wait y'all are not ready <gasps> no way it's freaking done oh I am absolutely obsessed. So this is what it looks like. Kinda slaying, kinda slaying. So obviously these pockets look weird. It says the show, but you can't really see it. Live on tour and just the text on these are so ugly and they look unfinished. And then I have these on the jacket. It just says the show, live on tour. The back is the coolest. So this is the back of the jacket. And I don't know if you can see it, but these are the pants. So the jacket has this sign that I painted. You can't really see it, but I tried to like remake a cartoon version of the little sign in the promo video for the show Live on Tour. So the pants obviously say NH, which is not important. I absolutely love. I'm absolutely obsessed. Watching my vision come to life with this outfit obviously could have been cooler. I thought I was gonna be a better painter, but it is what it is and it was what it was. As Tate McRae says, I'm happy with my effort and I think it turned out cool, to be honest. What we're gonna do now is I'm gonna put on like a podcast or a playlist or something and I'm gonna start packing. First I'm gonna make a to-do list because I need to make a to-do list. If not, my head is just gonna be spinning. Let's, let's just make a to-do list real quick. I have my little journal here and I'm gonna write out a to-do list. I am absolutely dying when it comes to my <coughs> sickness right now and I don't like this at all. Pack, film, edit, thumb, nail, post, clean. So those are the things that I need to do. So I'm just gonna put that there.
are we ready? I don't think we're ready. I'm not ready. I'm not personally ready to get this all packed up. Why am I always awake at such unreasonable times or whatever? It's five. It's five in the morning and I'm awake. And this is what happens when you have ADHD and your dopamine intake has been like this because you've had so much to do. And then you end up scrolling on TikTok for fast dopamine, you know. Literally had so many creative ideas this week and I've just been using all my time on that and now I'm burnt out and I'm dying and it's literally five o'clock and I need to go to sleep. We're gonna get to it. My outfit for day one is not complete yet. Half of these outfits aren't complete yet because things need to be washed and I also need to buy some things. My outfit for day one is this top from, I believe it's Kina, Kina Trico. It's really cute and I absolutely love it. So that's, this is travel day. So this is what I'll be wearing tomorrow night. And then these are the pants, which are just track pants, my school's track pants or whatever. I don't know if you call them track pants, it's just like sweatpants. My school's, my school's school merch sweatpants. I also have a sip of hoodie matching these pants that I'm gonna wear. I just cleaned that and I'm gonna take it out of the washing machine. Obviously going to need my jacket. I think I'm gonna roll it up like that. Yeah, I think that's good. Then I have these two books that I'm bringing because since we're flying for so long, if I finish my other book that I have in my bag, I have these to read when we're actually traveling just for good measure, I don't know. Then I'm bringing my favorite pair of pants from Sweet Skate. These are super cute. I absolutely love them. I have literally almost every week, I think, since 2021 when I got them. They last for a lifetime. They're the best pants ever. I love them. You can style them with anything. Baggy pants. I have them in black as well. Yeah, I just love them. I'm putting that in there. Then we have this belt, which is just a silver sparkly glitter belt, which I'm gonna use with my dad's suit pants, which I absolutely love. Then we have two different totes just for a good measure, honestly, to use when we're out of the city exploring. Preseason testing will be going on while I'm there, so I have to bring my Ferrari t-shirt. It's just a must. Then we have this Harry t-shirt that I'm just gonna have under a hoodie, so I'm just bringing it because I need it. Then we have my Nile hoodie, which I am bringing because it's cute and I'm gonna wear it one of the days, I think. It's Nile merch, so obviously I'm literally going there for four days just to see the guy. I need to wear it. Then I have my hair straightener. I make curls with this, so that's why I have that. Then we have some underwear, which I'm not gonna show you in detail because nobody wants to see that. Then we have my toiletry bag, which I have all my skincare stuff, all my hair care stuff, all my blah blah blah, you know? Then we have my other toiletry bag, which just have the essentials like toothbrush, toothpaste, mascara, eyelash curler, perfume, moisturizer, and uh, some q-tips, some bobby pins, some elastics, and my deodorant. And here I have all my makeup. Here comes the very front part. We're at the jewelry part. So I'm gonna put all my jewelry into this. I have two of these in each color. I have in light pink, dark pink, light blue, white, and dark purple. That's those. These butterfly ones. And two of each in blue, white, and pink. Then I have these cute little ones, two of them. And then I have these two bobby pins with like pearls on it. It's so cute. And then I just have some normal bobby pins and a mini elastic. Also, I have this, which I'm thinking of maybe putting in my hair at the show because it's like a Norwegian flag and we came all the way from Norway. So I'm gonna put this in my toiletry bag now. Now we're moving on to this one. We are doing necklaces. I'm bringing this Saturn one, which I actually gave to my sister, like a matching thing. She got the moon and I got Saturn for Christmas, which I bought. Uh, so then we have like, love you to the moon and to Saturn, which is a Taylor quote or lyric or whatever. And then we have the most important necklace of the whole trip, my N necklace, which is absolutely stunning. 
I got it from Ola, if you didn't know. And then I'm gonna bring this silver necklace with like a, I don't know, something in, in the middle. It's really cute. My friend Maria got it for me for Galentine's. And then I'm gonna bring this really cute gold bracelet. Then we're on to rings. I'm gonna bring this one, which is a broken silver bejeweled ish ring and i love that this is broken i think it looks so dope i love this ring got it from my mom and it's also a little rusty which i love i just love this ring so much and then i'm bringing my staple ring which is my sis ring i know a lot of norwegian girls have this ring like mom dad or sis or yolo or whatever and i have this because of my sister and i love my sister so i wear that like almost every day so then I'm just bringing these two like normal rings. Then we're over to earrings. So I'm bringing this pair from Blooms, which is really cute. Just like with some pink pearls, some gold, some shells, some moon. Really cute. Then I'm bringing my favorite pair of earrings from H&M actually that I bought last summer to see Nile. Um, probably the last time I was at an H&M actually. But yeah, these are really, really cute and I love them. And then I'm bringing the last pair of earrings are these really rusty ones, but I like it uh, with like a pink pearl and my sister actually made them. That's all of my jewelry that I'm bringing. I am bringing some more things. I'm bringing this leather jacket which I absolutely love. I got it. My mom gave it to me for my birthday and I absolutely adore this jacket. But I'm gonna wear it when we're traveling so I'm not gonna put it on now. I'm also bringing these shoes. They look like the Adidas Sambas, but it's, I don't think they are. The Adidas Gazelle, the blue ones. And it has like a blue stripe. I love these. These are so cute. And then tomorrow I'm also going to go out and I'm gonna buy a white backless t-shirt to wear at the Nile concert. And then I'm also going to buy a white baby tea normal baby tea and i'm gonna write my boyfriend is literally on stage on the baby tea i'm so excited i don't know if i'll film more for this video tomorrow but hello you guys it's the next day i've literally been slacking for the whole day i have not been doing what i should be doing but i'm gonna show you the last things that i needed that i bought for the trip i bought this top just a picture of me wearing it and i think it's super cute then we have this backless top just looks like this it's from gina in case you're wondering this one is in a size small and this one from big book is in a size extra small so yeah those are the two clothing items i'm gonna put this in my luggage right now and i'm gonna fix this later today. Isaac will be here in, I don't know, a few minutes, I think, like 10 minutes. So excited to see them. I also bought this energy drink. That's my favorite right now. I think I talked about it in the last video. It's absolutely immaculate and I need it for tomorrow because I'm gonna literally be dying tomorrow. Then I bought hair removal cream because I was out of it and I need it. I bought this hair thing, which I had one before. I used it as I used it at the Louis concert, but it broke. So you know, I needed a new one. I'm gonna pack that with myself. I bought this thing, which was not really necessary, but it says "not your bag," and it's like you can write your name, your address, your phone number, and your email on it. So I'm gonna write those things and put this on my bag. The last thing is super boring. I bought this blue kind of thin cardboard kind of thing to make a sign for the concert. And it's going to say, can I sing Seeing Blind with you? Although I have a throat infection, so we will see how that works out. That's basically it for this video. Honestly, I have gotten all of the things that I needed and I'm gonna pack it all up and I'm super excited to go to Belfast and stay tuned for the Belfast vlogs because they are coming out. See you guys in my next video. If you watched to the end of this video, I literally love you. Leave like the blue dress emoji. It's an emoji of a dress. Leave that if you got to the end of this video in the comments. You're the best. Bye. See you when we're traveling. Thank you.